Wow, that's really something. Very beautiful. That's what I call a house. What's up, Sammy? Wow, beautiful dwellings. Yeah, these are celebrities' houses. Why are you so interested in housing anyway? I'm looking for the best interior design. But we've already built so many houses. Do you want more? A cool and famous slime like me needs something really posh. <laughs> okay, then. Let's try and build one. Hi, guys. Today we're going to make a beautiful Monet's garden house. Another house? You promised a really luxurious villa, huh? Yes, you're right. But no matter what you call it, all buildings have something in common. And what is that? Their construction begins with the base and walls. So you're saying all the houses in the world are the same? Well, more or less. You're wrong! I just checked. There is a house in Tokyo called House T, and it has neither inner walls nor ceiling. Wow, I'm so lucky that you're so curious. In the meantime, I finished the first cupboard. Let's place it right here. Hmm. Don't take it personal, but if you ask me, it looks a bit empty. How about now? Now we're talking! I really hope our viewers like it as much as you do. Sue, I found a very strange window. I guess it's not good for our craft. Oh, just in time. Thanks, Sammy. It's actually a perfect fit. You're just not into interior design. Of course! Everyone knows that I'm more into decor. Take this! Thanks! Guys, give us a thumbs up to support Sammy. He totally deserves that. Although, yet he didn't have an opportunity to show his decorator skills today. There we go. There's still time! All right, we will see then. And this wall goes here. Hup. By the way, Sammy, can you try and guess what this room I'm making now is for? Hmm, it's so tiny. Is it a storage room or something? I'd say it's not so convenient to store something in here with such a big hole in the wall. <laughs> Actually, it looks kind of cozy. I could just sit there and think about life. And many people do, because it's a bathroom. I guess this thingy is what you're missing, then. Go ahead and set it. Mm, uh, ta -da! You did a great job, Sammy. Now let's hang a chandelier. We need to pull the wire through this hole in the wall. There we go. Done! Awesome! Sue, why didn't you wait for me to build that room? You've even made this cute table. Come on! I just wanted to set more time for the decor, Sammy. You always keep talking about how important this part is for any craft. You'll see that for yourself right now! Whoosh! How did you like that? Cool! This way this place looks much better! Hmm, let there be light! Roger that! Hooray! It works great! Do maybe we could make a staircase? Oh, right! Sorry, I almost forgot about it! Here we go! The staircase looks so luxurious with this banister, too! All right! Now you don't need to jump anymore! <laughs> And the finishing touch! Great! I can't wait to decorate the second floor! One more thing. I'm sure you won't say no to swings in the house. I say yay! Oh, this is so cute. Mm-hmm. Sue, can I start decorating the bathroom? Pretty please, I already know what to do! <laughs> I don't see why not. Finally! Wow, Sammy, it looks so elegant! Wait till you see the best part! What a beautiful mirror! I want one too! <laughs> Actually, I wasted no time either! What do you say? It perfectly fits my style! I've been thinking, maybe I should go in for an architect since I'm so good at interior design. Oh, Sammy, you're really messing things up. In fact, there's a big difference between being an architect and being an interior designer. Speaking
Speaking plainly, an architect works on the outer part of a house and a designer on the inner part. Do you get it now? Different skills are needed. I'm so lucky I have you, Susie. You're incredibly smart. I'm flattered. <laughs> By the way, Sammy, could you please lend me your magic wand? Sure, but what are you gonna conjure? You'll see. <laughs> Lumos Maxima. Wow, Sue, isn't that a spell from the Harry Potter story? Exactly. We didn't read all the books for nothing. Let's continue. It's time to assemble the living room. Here comes the centerpiece of any dwelling. <laughs> now let's place a little carpet here and a coffee table on top of it. There's no living room without a cozy couch, right? Susie, I've been thinking. Who's this Monet? And why is the house called Monet's Garden anyway? <laughs> oh, Sammy. Claude Monet was a French artist and the founder of Impressionist painting. The patterns on the walls of this house resemble this style. And you'll see about the garden. Look, I found one of his paintings. It's so beautiful. Yeah, these water lilies look so real. Uh, um, Sue, how much time do we need to finish? Mm, not much. Why are you asking? Building a house is so exhausting. I could use a little break. <laughs> I've just started to assemble a bed. So you're kind of in time. Let's do it together. It would be way faster. Okay, I'm ready for construction works. Actually, I wanted to ask you to deal with the decor. I can do that too! Guys, did you know that the most expensive bed in the world called Baldacchino Supreme Bed costs $6,300,000? Give a thumbs up if you'd like to sleep on this luxurious furniture piece. Okay, now we need to attach the legs to the bed. Wait a second, I think this relates to decor, and I'm the one in charge of that. Mm-hmm. Ta-da! Well, what do you think, Sue? I'm glad you're so good at it. But what about your main task? Here comes real magic. Wow, it looks amazing. Sammy, I can see you're really chipper. Have you changed your mind about a nap? Creative process always cheers me up. Good for you. And here comes this adorable nightstand. Don't forget about the carpet, guys. Oh, I have an idea. Let's see. I hope you like it. Are you kidding me? These are so adorable. By the way, Sue, do you mind if I assemble one room all by myself? Huh? <laughs> Can't wait to see the result. How can you be so sure? Because I know that you're a pro. Okay, go ahead. I wonder what he's up to. Any ideas, guys? Give us a thumbs up if you're interested as much as I am. <laughs> Sue, I'm ready. Check it out. Holy cannoli, Sammy. It's wonderful. Would you look at this cute tent, guys? I told you I should have been a designer. Aw, I wish I had a room exactly like this one when I was a kid. It's great that you've grown up and can make any room to your liking. <laughs> and we've got the most interesting part, the musical mechanism. Oh, let's find out a melody. <laughs> You'll have to wait, mister. I want everything right now. Sammy is always putting the cart before the horse. <laughs> huh? What can I do if I want to see the results? I clearly remember it was somewhere here. Or maybe here? Ugh, this must be somewhere around. Are you looking for this? Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'm not even surprised that you know where the refrigerator was. <laughs> It'll become much prettier when I work on the decor. Close your eyes, Sue. This slime is always full of ideas. Wow, Sammy, you're so gifted. And of course, I can recognize your sweet tooth style. <laughs> A little bit of cake won't do any harm. <laughs> oh yeah, you're a true expert in this field. Don't take it personally, Sue, but... Don't you think this table looks a bit empty? Let's add a napkin then. That's not enough. You know what I like very much? Tea with sweets. <laughs> A 
and you read a lot, so there should be more books. <laughs> You're right, Sammy. Carefully. Great. Mm -hmm. Something is still missing. Margarita. A little bowl of almonds? Some fruit? Hmm. I think it would look much better with this. Do you like it, Susie? Yes, you're so sweet, Sammy. In the meantime, we're at the finish line. It's so beautiful. By the way, guys, you can check out lots of other cool houses we've made on our channel. They are no worse than this one, so I strongly recommend you do this too, my friends. Hmm, I think we're missing just a little bit of greenery. Hup, that's much better. Do you want to have another look at this luxurious house, Sammy? You don't need to ask, do. Sammy, I can see you like it very much! Do you understand now why it's called Monet's Garden? Of course! All this decor, and beautiful paintings on the wall, and a wonderful garden with a view! <laughs> yes, that's right! Guys, if you like our new house as much as Sammy, give us a thumbs up! And don't forget to hit the bell button to not miss our upcoming videos! Subscribe to our channel! Bye-bye! I wish summer would get here sooner. Do you have any holiday plans? I want us to go traveling. Yeah, that would be cool. In our own trailer. Whoa, what ambitious dreams you have. And we can even sell our house. And where are we gonna live? What do you mean where? In the trailer, of course. <laughs> That's hard to imagine. Don't need to do that. I'll show you everything you need to know right now. Hmm, sounds intriguing. Let's go and see your project then. Hi, guys. Today we're gonna make our summer dreams come true. A dream is a wish your heart makes. Oh, I'm sure I saw this cafe in my dream last night. <laughs> it was a nice dream then. What was in that cafe? I just remember it was bright and spacious and awesome! Ah, uh, Sammy, try not to ruin all these magazines. Our visitors won't have anything to read. It'll be worse if we don't have anything to sit on. <laughs> don't worry, I've taken care of that. And I brought a designer table from Spain. <laughs> but it seems I forgot the table legs. Check this out. They came from Spain on their own. <laughs> and our table will stand firmly. Ah, a roadside cafe idea is so romantic. I'd make a movie about it. Then you should learn more about cinematography. I've already read this one. Catch! Hop, got it. <laughs> Seems like our cafe will be visited by many creative wanderers. And we'll inspire them with these motivational posters. And cheer them up with funny ones, too. <laughs> And I'd like to have a magazine about modern architecture. It's so fascinating. Wow! We're in sync, Susan! Thanks, Sammy. You can leave the flowers on the table. Here we go! The more flowers, the better. <laughs> Guys, you can imagine your favorite scent. Uh, I'd imagine raspberry jam or hot chocolate. <laughs> Though they're not flower scents, they definitely smell good. Brought enough decor stuff. Where will we put all of it? Just wait a bit. I'll speed up so that we can move forward. Hop. Coffee, hot drinks, and dessert. Ah, I could eat it and drink it all day. Holy cannoli soup! You made it so fast. And I've also prepared another one. You can decorate it to your liking. Whoa! This is the perfect task for me. Slimes are the best at decorating. Is there anything in the world slimes are not good at? <laughs> Only if they're lazy enough. Or hungry. Hmm, it seems that you're not hungry now. You're very active. 
Well, that's a rare state of mind. <laughs> then we'd better use it. <laughs> Put anything you like right here. Whoa! Sure, I'll do my best. While Sam's busy, we'll continue working. Hmm, let's see. Ah, this is heaven in a cup. Oopsie! Sue, do you need my help? You're on time, Sammy. I'm making another shelf here. We'll have lots of decor in the cafe so that it looks cozier and cuter. We know everything about cuteness. <laughs> here you go, Sue. This is gonna be a shelf with three levels. Looks very modern, right? I'm absolutely sure it's slime design. Wow, looks very cool. Well, maybe I'm not the best decorator like slimes, but I can do something too. You're amazing, Susan. Guys, give her a thumbs up if you agree. Guys, we're only halfway through. Next comes an awesome trailer. Stay tuned. Beep beep, clear the path. The trailer is coming! Don't you think something's missing here? Uh, I'd say a lot is missing. <laughs> but we're working on it. Guys, have you ever traveled in a trailer? I believe this is amazing! It's a real mobile home! Did you know that in the 1920s, people who traveled in these trailers were referred to as tin can tourists? <gasps> Shiver me, Chatters! That was quite a long time ago! <laughs> I promise we'll take a trip someday, too. Hey, it looks like an emoji! <laughs> hmm, I wonder how many people use travel trailers nowadays? I think a lot. Actually, caravanning became popular in North America about a hundred years ago. And the origins of caravanning can be traced back to the Romani people. Our trailer will be the coolest thing can then! Am I right, Susan? <laughs> Absolutely, Sammy. Could you please attach the wheels? <laughs> Attention, guys! Road work ahead! Now we have to furnish our trailer from the inside. And from the outside, too! Check this out! We can attach our luggage to it! <laughs> Don't forget that we have to climb in there somehow. Here's a side ladder. We defo should take a surfboard! <laughs> I want to visit the coast! Uh, uh, uh. We'll totally need more bags to bring with us. Shake, shake, let's create one. Whoosh! <laughs> Ooh, I love these tiny travel stickers. That's a must-have for travel lovers. I'll go packing then! Leave it to me! <laughs> Guys, do you want to see all of our travel stuff? Here we go! But why can't we use our trailer as a diner, too? Shakes and fizzy drinks. All you need for hot summer days. Ah, relax time! Sue, can I have a slimy sunset? <laughs> Is that your signature cocktail? First, let's finish our cafe. And our trailer is ready! Looking good, huh? Sue, we should also have a place to rest our eyes! Like a little garden! I trust your taste, Sammy. Let's do it! We'll make a garden in the shape of… a small box. Sammy, you can find the flowers you'd like to plant here. Hey, old Timmy Daba! I can be a real gardener now! <laughs> in that case, our garden will be waiting for flowers. There's no roadside cafe without a road sign. This is gonna be a cafe on the sea. Sue, so you just read my mind! Here's the sign! We're a dream team, Sam. <laughs> Let's put the sign on the lamppost. I'm done! Here is slime laziness in action. <laughs> okay, let's take a short break and continue then. Woohoo, let's go! Guys, we still have a couple of items to finish before we start rearranging the furniture. Sending lots of hearts to you, Susan. We can do this! I have no doubt. <laughs> By the way, guys, guess how many hearts are on this chair? Susan, here's one for you! Uh, seems like I lost the other side. This one, right? I found it near a flower pot. Cause it's a stand for flower pots we're making. Exactly. And I'm sure we need one more. Ta-da! <laughs> Guys, which one do you like the most? Thumbs up for the yellow and subscribe for the blue. I'll finish the rest, Sue. Easy peasy. Then we can start building our cafe here. Hmm, do you have any ideas for what it'll look like? Make way! First floor is coming! <laughs> I love this combination of yellow walls and blue window frames. And on the second floor, it'll be the other way around. And here is a lighted sign so that people can see our cafe even in the dark. This inner brick wall looks so cool. 
Sammy, what do you think? I think it's time to redo our house. <laughs> Take this. <laughs> Let's finish our cafe first. One house at a time. The first floor will be very cozy with lots of tiny details. And here's the first table we made. Who wants to read about movies? Hmm? Uh-huh. Slowly. A little more to the left. Now to the right. Okay, perfect. Hey! It can't be just one wall. Whoops, we'll fix it right now. Here's another one. And here comes one more. Done! <laughs> Sammy, you're a real builder in your heart. I'm so proud of you. Ah, uh, what can I say? Crafters should be able to do everything. Even if it means knowing some magic tricks like this. And whoosh! Ladies and gentlemen, we have tables for groups of friends as well as for lonely souls. Anyway, you'll feel comfortable and warm here. Especially with a cup of hot chocolate. Were you able to check out the interior? We're building walls. Sue, did you start without me? Wait! Oh, it's almost finished. <laughs> awesome! Let's place this fence here for extra safety. Keep your face to the sunshine. This is our wish for you guys. Please visit our cafe when we open it. And I upgraded the other side. Check it out! Wow, Sammy! It looks like a real cargo box. That's amazing! Guys, do you like this cafe design? Give us a thumbs up. And this bicycle will make you like it even more! <laughs> and this is what our little gardener made. Sue, so you just need your own garden. Cause that's a cafe, not a greenhouse. Uh, I know, but can we try, Sammy? I'd love that. Uh, I just can't resist you. Let's do our best. Sammy, you made it! And it's even better than I expected! I always work at 150%. Learn that from you, Susan! Sammy! <gasps> High five, Sammy! We did it! It's time for the grand opening! Here you go! Mm. Sue, this is the best summer of my life! <laughs> I can just imagine how happy you will be when it comes for real. And then there will be autumn! Sue, we should prepare for that too! Slow down! We have plenty of time! And now let's just relax and enjoy our cafe! And my slimy shake, of course! <laughs> Guys, do you like our miniature houses? Give this video a thumbs up! We'll be happy if you do! Don't forget to subscribe to our channel! Bye-bye! I need this. <laughs> and this. <sighs> Sammy? Uh, Sammy? Yes, Susie? Uh, what are you doing there? Whoa. <laughs> I'm gonna make a lemonade stand. Oh, I used to have one when I was a kid. Really? How much money did you make? My customers were mostly my parents and neighbors. Oh, that was the time. I even dreamed of becoming a small cafe owner. That could be nice. Just imagine a hot summer day, people walking around, one might get thirsty, and there I am, offering them a nice glass of fresh lemonade. Interesting. I hate you. Why don't we make your childhood dream come true? Ugh, no, Sammy, I'm not ready for noisy construction. And then we'll need a license. And Easy, Susie. I was talking about a scale model. Oh. Now that I can do, let's go! Yay! Hi guys, today's stream is gonna come true! Don't rush 
crush the event, Sammy. Hi, everyone. We're going to build a scale model of a wonderful and cozy cafe. By the way, we build scale models quite often. You can watch those videos on our channel. Where do we start? As always, with the floor and a couple of main walls. This one is definitely missing a cute little window. <laughs> there you go. Much better. I found this thingy. As far as I know, it is part of a music box or something. Oh, that's right. Since we're talking about a cafe, it can't do without music. Let's put this piece right here next to the entrance. Oh, what music will it play? Some hard rock, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> this will be a surprise for you and the guys. Watch this video to the end to find out. Huh. I like how the pink door matches the white brick wall. Actually, this will be quite an unusual door. I mean, the way it opens. And... Ta-da! Wow, great idea, Susie! Thanks, Sammy. And now it's time to set the floor. <gasps> that means I can start picking out the furniture and decorations and everything! Wow! <laughs> Looks like it's been quite a while since we built our last scale model. <laughs> the floor is done. Now we can deal with the zoning of the whole space starting from the first floor. How many floors will this building have, Sue? Hmm, I think two floors will be perfectly enough for a small and cozy place like this. <laughs> Gee, guys, your musical mechanism is now well hidden from prying eyes. <laughs> Since that's an outside part of our cafe, there should be some beautiful grass. Ready for some magic? Perfect! This will be a nice place for those who are waiting for their turn to come inside. Yeah, meanwhile they can look... Wow! I jumped them beautiful! All we need is light! Wonderful! <laughs> Hi, Joe. Oh, well, we're making a mini cafe, right? Yes, Sammy. Then there should be some kind of a bar, right? <laughs> of course, that's quite obvious. Why are you asking? Because, uh, <laughs> I kind of already made one. <gasps> That's great, Sammy. But don't you think that it's kind of empty? You're right. Okay, I'm on it. In the meantime, guys, this is what I've got. Two almost identical pieces with lamps. But only one of them is connected to the wires. This counter must have a computer in order to keep track of the orders, you know. Speaking of orders, we should give our customers a variety of choices, right? What do you say about the counter now, Suzanne? Hmm, let's see. Now it's perfect, Sammy. By the way, I wonder what your favorite part is in a cafe. Huh. The less sophisticated, the better. <laughs> I feel uncomfortable having plenty of different forks and spoons on my table. They make me feel nervous. Oh, yeah, Sammy. We know how impatient you get with food. <laughs> but what makes you feel good in a public eating space, then? Food, of course! And pillows. Lots of pillows. <laughs> Noted, Sammy. As for me, when choosing a place to have lunch, I pay attention to the food and the atmosphere. I like it when dim music plays and the waiters are polite but not too bothersome. <laughs> and you're right, Sammy. The fewer types of forks there are, the better. <laughs> it would also be nice to have something fancy to look at. Decorative guys. Oh, Sammy, you truly are a master of decor. Do you agree, guys? Give us a thumbs up and we'll continue. Guys, our cafe won't be a regular one. If you watch this video longer, you'll find out why. So why do you need this? Oh, thank you. You too, my impatient friend. Just wait a little bit more. This is the dream cafe after all, and one should always be ready to wait for the dream to come true. Huh? Wow. Two is not for pillows in the cup of coffee. I'd say this looks like a swimming pool. <laughs> oh, that totally is a swimming pool! What's going on? <laughs> Don't you always have something tasty while floating in a donut through the pool? Oh, <laughs> that's true. But uh, don't worry, there'll be a regular table right here. It needs a couple of chairs. One and two. Perfect! Susie, I made this. Uh, I'm not sure whether it's a small table or a stool. Oh, it's okay, Sammy. We have a perfect spot for it over here. Huh. I thought you mentioned the second floor earlier. That's right. Here it is! Why don't I start working on the interior elements? Good idea, Sammy. In the meantime, we'll set the walls. 
I always love buildings with unusual shapes of walls and windows. Let's make those in this cafe, too. Oh, guys, while Sam's away, I want to blow his mind. What do you say? Does this look like a tiny faucet? Check out this amazing banister that I made myself! <gasps> What's that? Is it a... Uh... A bathtub? Yeah, I thought, why not? Let's just add some more foam and a few bubbles. Cool, huh? Uh, unexpected at least. <laughs> okay, guys, let's speed up the process a bit. Ta-da! This is the couch. Cute! And this is gonna be a drawer unit. <laughs> I love its color. And this is a table with flowers. To check out how I arranged everything, I am a master of interior after all. That was fast, Sammy. You even set up the walls? Okay, it's my turn. I'm gonna put this sofa and this unusual table. And add a few tiny but very atmospheric details. Here comes a picture. More green plants. And cute box with newspapers. I think one tiny table is not enough for the whole second floor, Susie. Oh, you're right, Sammy. Let's put another counter right here. Perfect. That's better. It became immediately cozier. Hmm. Seems like I forgot something. The chair show. <gasps> right. <laughs> oh, here they are. Shoo, let's add something more. Oh, good idea, Sammy. What idea? To add a skateboard. <laughs> and some magazines. Here's the banister. It looks perfect, Sammy. Oh, no. <laughs> Check this out, too. Oh, that's fantastic, Sammy. All we need to do is set the whole second floor in its place. Ta-da! And put the ladder. Uh, Sammy, could you bring that to me? A ladder? Hey, just a moment. Uh, this one? Oh! <laughs> mm, no, Sammy, but thanks. I almost forgot about this piece. It goes right here as some kind of tiny roof. This is the ladder. So let's set it in its place and... You're done! Last but not least, a furry visitor of the cafe. Idea. I'm always at your service, Susie. <laughs> oh, by the way, I remember you were saying something about having a snack while taking a bath. I see what you're up to. Go turn on the water and I'll make you a sandwich. <laughs> Yay! Oh, sorry, guys. It was fun with you today. Subscribe to our channel and watch more fun videos with Susie and me. And don't forget to hit the bell button. Bye-bye, everyone. <laughs>